Hello and welcome to this third video on how to search for and reserve an e-audiobook on our BorrowBox app. I'm using an Android device today, but you can also get the app on Apple devices and Kindle Fire as well. If you haven't yet signed up for BorrowBox, there's instructions on how to do that in a separate video and another video with instructions on how to borrow an item. So let's open the BorrowBox app now. Okay, so we're going to look at the menu at the bottom of the screen. And on the very right of that menu, you can see there's a search. So we tap on search, and then a search bar appears at the top of the screen. Tap inside that, and we can search for an author. We could search for a title, or we could put a combination of the author's name and a title if we wish. I'm going to search for Jacqueline Wilson. And just tap search. And you can see the titles that are available for Jacqueline Wilson are there. So some of those are on loan, we can see. And if we'd like the look of any of them, we just tap. And in this instance, we'd have to reserve it. We won't do that right now. Um, I can always, if I want to, tap on available only. And I'll be able to see the titles that are available to borrow straight away. I'm going to deselect that for now. And I'm going to clear the search that we just did. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to type in an author's surname, so it's Smith, and I'm going to put in a book title as well, and tap on search. And that brings us straight to the, the book that I was looking for, but I can see at the moment it's on loan and it's not available for quite a long time. now. We do um, endeavour to buy extra copies of books when there's a, a long waiting list, but we do also have to balance that with buying new content for BorrowBox, which we like to do quite regularly. So in this instance, we can tap on the book and you can see at the bottom, it gives us the option to preview and on the right of that reserve. So I'm going to tap reserve and it tells us um, after confirming this reserve, we'll have seven loans available. As we said before, you have eight e-audiobook loans available, and that includes reserves as well. So I'm going to tap Confirm Reserve, and you can see it tells us that we've been successful uh, when the book's available, and also it tells us a reminder email will be sent, which is quite useful. Um, you don't always have to wait as long as it says. Um, as I said before, people can return books early, um, we can sometimes buy extra copies if there's a, a big demand. So it may not be waiting quite as long as you think. And there's always lots to borrow in the meantime as well. So I'll just confirm that. And now I'm going to go back. And back to my loans at the bottom left. I'm just going to scroll down and show you that in reserves, we can see all the e-audiobooks that we've reserved and when they'll be available, it shows up on the right hand side. So that concludes our tour around the BorrowBox app for Android. We really hope you enjoy using the app and until next time, take care. Mm -hmm.